Hey, what's up you guys? Aftershare Reacts here, and today I'm gonna be playing some more of the Telltale game uh, of Thrones. <laughs> um, so this is episode 2. Uh, if you have not checked out episode 1, I highly um, suggest that you do, because, um, well this would be spoilery I suppose, because we're probably gonna be talking about the events of season, uh, of episode 1. Yeah, so this is um, a continuation of uh, my Game of Thrones month, um, so it's really exciting. Um, let's get into it. Let's make some dumb decisions. Oh, this is Asha. Oh, this is the Yunkai five, three days since liberation. Yunkai. Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it and find out. So this is the guy that was exiled as well. So it's interesting. Oh hell yeah, let's taste it. It's blood. <laughs> oh wow, you're not in great shape. Looks like he's How's he doing? doing? <laughs> we need him alive to collect his bounty. Get him. <laughs> no. Does Asha scare you? <laughs> you should see him when he's angry. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? So he wants to go They home. treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking yeah, okay. cares? Good point, Beska. I have them sometimes. Just, just remember. Butter up. We have a good thing here. To us. Aye, to us. <laughs> You're not that drunk, are you? Sorry. <laughs> Fine, have it your way. <laughs> I tell me to press W when ready, so I press W. Biscuit? Twice, even though it's a few. slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. And that's all you're getting. Fuck you! Fuck you! He's worth twice that. <laughs> Look at the balls on this one. Bloody hell! And we're done with you too. You're gonna regret that. You just that. made a huge mistake, Tazel. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. Flip the table! <laughs> Alright, who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of the <laughs> Kill them! Now! Ah. Yeah, that's right. I keep staring your face. No, no I'm no. more like. Here's one. Hey. Ah. Ah. Come on! She couldn't have passed me! Uh-oh. You fail one little quick term event and everything goes down the drain. <sighs> she couldn't have passed me! Oh, what happened again? <laughs> This reminds me of <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop. Break his neck. <laughs> bust his knee? Are you kidding me? Your brother Ethan sent me. He's I'm here to bring you home. <laughs> Roderick. Roderick? Roderick! By oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! 
Roderick! The milk of a puppy. Drink. Come now. Refuse it. Don't be stubborn, my lord. No. <gasps> Roderick! My lady! <laughs> As it is, you may never walk again. Aw. You should meet Bran. Roderick? <gasps> he refused the milk of the puppy. <sighs> That's Roderick for you. Brave as always. But the pain must be. <gasps> Roderick! <gasps> Roderick! Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Are like it was nothing. Let him leave. Ethan. How could this happen Ramsey to him? Ramsey will pay! I'll make Ramsey pay for what he did. I promise. You can do this, Roderick. I know you can. Yeah, just leave it. <laughs> oh, no. Patrick. <laughs> I'm not sure if it was supposed to fall over, but I tried to make Fine. him run, so that's kind of funny. Not really, but, you know. <laughs> oh, I can't bother pressing Q for that long. You abandon your post? Or do you just fancy dying someplace cold? Actually, I'd like to volunteer. You just want to serve the realm, is that it? Yes, sir. You're a bad liar, Gary Tuttle. How do you know my name? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. You lied to me the first chance you got. Yes. You'll fit in because well I here. I like to make questionable decisions. I'm just gonna not respond. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. Should have buried him with the corpses. You know what? Forest is a curse. Real shame about your leg, oh, Lord. Give us a toss. You know what? Let's let's burn what the corpses. What a disgrace to his house. Let's ask Cersei for some wildfire, and we're good. Go round. Don't test you me. You don't want to test me. Is that right? Because you look pretty sad to me. Bring it on. Go on then, my lord. Yes, right back down. Please. If they riot, we'll fight. That's foolish. It doesn't matter what you think. It's my decision as Sentinel. Yeah, you're not Sentinel. My Lord. Why do you keep thinking you ever say? Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. She just likes to see me do this. <gasps> my Lord. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned... The marriage can proceed as planned. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Keep the Give drunk. them wine. I want them dull, not angry. Yes, my lord. Now, if there's nothing Wait, more I to discuss. With the annoying one? I don't know. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. That's a very big family. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Send him away again. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. 
She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking <laughs> such things. Pay no mind to her. She asks Let's too suck much. Suck up to Marjorie no matter what. <laughs> She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. Mira, you have been so patient, so loyal. Your loyalty will not go unrewarded. I'm seeing Grandmother today. She'll have some ideas about your brother's predicament. I'm sure she can help. That's a if crazy good Lady Marjorie wrote a letter. <laughs> Do it! Dear Lady Elena. No. Dearest Lady Elena. Let's get her in trouble. <laughs> Mira. Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind. I'd rather not. I don't know if I like the sound of that. Don't worry, it's... <sighs> Oi, fuckhead. You might be new here, but you're in my spot. So move. I'm not moving. <laughs> Wrong fucking answer. Most of you will okay, be Sheldon. dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the Night's Watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the wall? I don't care. The wall was erected over 8,000 oh, yeah, years ago. To and I don't the care. Make you should. White walkers, I had this girl I used to fuck now and again. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some lordly. He tried to stick me with this. I stuck it in him instead. So next time I say move, you best fucking move. Shut up for once, will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what diacrime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Potatoes? You fuck you potatoes? Fuck potatoes. What? No! I stole them. Cut at the potato fucker. Says one for the songs. Who in seven hells is talking back there? Uh, potato fucker and this dude Finn. Tuttle, who was it? These two were arguing. <laughs> Rat and bite right now. <laughs> Not wise to point the finger at your new brothers, Tuttle. I don't care. I'm a Tuttle tail. Jared Tuttle here wants to be a ranger. I just really want to talk to John. <laughs> Nothing else matters to me. No, John, come back! I walked up the stairs and he walked away from me. Oh no, John! Are you shooting them at the ground? You're, are you shooting them at your foot? You're a fucking idiot! Oh my god. You're doing that all wrong. But well, we don't yeah. have these, we're like. You're a fucking idiot! Oh, <laughs> Man's Raider will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Let me show you. Not so easy, is it? Bloody recruits. All right, let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's ass. Shoot the targets I tell you to. Oh, great. Let's start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. Okay. Can I... Something wrong with your eyes? <laughs> but I want to shoot him! Oh, no. It, like, clicks off the game. It's Hit the dummies where I tell you. Okay, um... I want to shoot him. I really, really want to You know, marksman, that's for certain. Ha <laughs> ha! That was way off the mark. I know. Next bolt. Left target. Head. Okay. 
So left target, head. So... Aha! Stop daydreaming! Right target, chest. Okay. So that means... Disgraceful. Center, between the eyes. Wanna be a... Uh... Fucking pay attention, recruit! Seven hell, you're terrible. He completed the crossbow test. Yes, I did good. That's why I took this. Swiped it right off him. Don't so, tell, all right. Good job. Not that I don't hard. think he'd take it kindly. I can't I'm promise trust. anything. I'm trusting you. <laughs> don't let me down. Even though I ratted you out before. Gonna do some workouts. Want some help? <laughs> oh, you just always have to show me up, don't you? You know what? Just for this one, I'm gonna do it correctly. <laughs> Where am I taking it to? I mean, it's not <laughs> Why don't you shove him? Don't hurt yourself, Tuttle. Back off! I'm gonna call Fuck you off, head. Bloody ass. Mind your language, Garrett. Mr. Johnson. <laughs> I'm just gonna fail. Wake up! I said it's a chest, not a blade. Alright. You told me to wake up, I'll wake up. Get well ready. four. I was just playing you before. Get off me, you bloody ox. You got lucky. You're pathetic. Fuck off. You didn't even Stop try. Stop picking on my bestie! A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my... Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it... Potter, Potter took it. Took it. <laughs> you little fucking thief. I just wanted to be off. I did say I would do it. Give me my knife. I don't have it, I swear! Out of my way! Watch it. What the fuck? Shit. Uh -oh. Hey, look. Fight! Fight! Yeah, get Here they go again. Fuck this. Punch him in the fucking slap him! Yeah, bitch! Get wrecked! You look so good now, aren't you? Get off! What ah. is going on here? He stole my fucking knife! No, I didn't! And Garrett knew You just got pulled off the by a jump star and I realize how that sounds now. Yeah, never mind. Come with me. Yay! I get to be with Jon Snow! It's all I wanted in my life. I'm not very good at this sort of thing. Listen, to me. if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise to keep it to yourself. You can tell no one. I want to trust you. Sarah, just I'm tell gonna me. I'm going to tell right. someone. <laughs> Fine. Just please, keep it a secret. My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. She became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah Flowers. You're a bastard? Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am. I know that. But to always have to hide. I don't care. I don't want to hide from you as well. 
What of your father? Who is he? I don't know. Sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might suggest she talk to me instead. Give me a chance to win her over. Coming from you, Why would I do that? Mean a lot. <laughs> and what would I stand to gain if I did this? Seven oh, wow. hells, Mira. Do you ever think about anyone besides yourself? Nope. I came to you for help. Why should I care, Why about, should you? I care about your <laughs> problems? This is King's Landing. <laughs> you must look out for yourself before I'm all else. I love it. <sighs> Maybe you're right. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Since I'm certain my sister didn't give Sarah it to took you. it. <laughs> Sarah took the wine from the cellars. <laughs> you? I, uh... I'm just running people like left, it's right, It's always set up. the quiet ones. I suggest bringing cups next time. Lord Whitehill will hear of this. He's not a man to take such matters lightly. Tear him down! <laughs> Lord Tyrion. This mother of dragons and her cell swords are headed north, so we make for Marine. Wait, Marine? Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't okay, afford any distractions. It's not that? your problem. It'll be fine. I promise. What business? What kind of unfinished business? The kind I'd rather keep to myself. That I thought we were getting places. I thought that you wanted me and you'd tell me everything. Oh crap. I, I didn't even do that, by the way. It didn't Ponte Renas! Yonkai Heroncho si bota con costoti da or. Kill the soldier. Uh oh. Gotcha. I messed up. Kill the soldier. Here we go. Let's go. You're quick, I'll give you that. But you're reckless. If I have to, I will murder my way to Ramsay Snow and cave his bloody head in. You two can talk about it later. We need to get out of here. Just remember that you'll want to see gentleness in you too. I don't mean to burden you with unwanted advice. But this is an important day for got... all of us. Let me handle this, Mother. You're right. I'm sorry. I need to ask you something. When I arrived at Ironrath today, your courtyard was filled with drunken soldiers. White Hill soldiers. They said some terrible things. My father is questioning the wisdom of our betrothal. And I was inclined to agree with him until I received a curious letter from Marjorie Tyrell. What did it say? Lady Marjorie suggests in the kindest of terms that we go through with the marriage. And as you can imagine, a suggestion from a future queen is difficult to ignore. Do you know why Lady Marjorie would send this to me? She and I have never corresponded. Yet now she writes me directly. Lady Marjorie must have her reasons. Do you think I'm naive? I don't know what favors you had to call in, but I feel manipulated, Roderick. A house like mine can't refuse a suggestion from Marjorie Tyrell. I'm being forced to marry you, Roderick. Is that truly what you want? Would you do that to me? Yes. If this <laughs> is the only way to secure an alliance, then yes. For my family. You trapped me, Roderick. Very well. I'll tell my father our betrothal stands. But this will be a marriage of necessity. And I do not expect it will be a happy one. Eh, you grow Deepest to apologies, me. my lord. I tried to stop him, but sure. he Roderick can be very convincing. Can I change your mind? You can do much better than this crap. Get out. Now. Lud, enough of this. Fuck you! Fuck your soldiers. Fuck you. Too. Roderick, please. See? That's just the kind of arrogance I'm talking about. Sure, Lady Elaine, eh? you respect your betters. Kneel. Kiss my shiny ring. No. Just do it. Robert. I didn't do it before, and I'm not gonna. You do don't it want now. to end up like your brother, do you? I'm not kissing your ring. 
do what you must. Fine. I'll just tell Ryan you didn't want to see him. No, please. And because of your defiance, I'm taking what should have been mine in the first place. The other half of the Ironwood Forest. You can't Ramsey do that. Ramsay Snow I said... know what Ramsay said. I'm saying something else. My men have a name for you. Roderick the Ruined. <laughs> Isn't that clever? No. No, no, no. You'd put your pride ahead of your family. What's poor Ryan Absolutely. going to think? Absolutely. That we've abandoned him? I couldn't kiss his ring in front of Elena. She would have understood. Just tell me to be a little bitch. I ain't kissing her ring. Now the Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. I want to kill. I them. wish I could have killed them myself. I keep thinking if I'd been there, I could have done something. But chances are, I'd be dead too. It's okay. Whatever I once thought, my promise. place is here. With the night, I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. <gasps> Are we gonna get to see Samuel? I love Samuel. Oh. Can you see past your differences? You if you ask me to, I will. I'll do anything you want. Glad to hear it. Where do you think oh. you're going? At this time of night. None of your business. That's none of your concern. Oh, I think it is. Do you know what this uniform means? It means you serve the Lannisters. So, you best get yourself back to your chambers. And I mean, now. If you don't like it, you can take it up with the commander. Is there no way I can change your mind? Did you not hear me? At ease, Lucan. The lady is with me. Yes. I am sorry about this, Mira. But you've made enemies of the wrong people. A handmaiden should know her place. What people? I'll make this quick if that helps. I'd hate to see you suffer. <gasps> what the hell? <coughs> Why are you trying to kill me? You had to do, Lady Mira. You had no choice. I need to get back. Someone might see me. I'll take care of him. I know a few places in Fleetwood. No one will ever find him. Don't tell anyone. I won't. Everything all right, sir? <gasps> Damien, where are you? father wanted to murder Russia for your little love affair, remember? That was a long time ago. May we speak privately? My lady? Roderick, I came here because... I know how hard these past few days must have been for you and your family. I know my words probably mean nothing to you. Your father caused this. He asked me if his father died because he was a coward. He asked if he was really a thief and a traitor like my father says. I don't wish to upset you, but... Damn your father! 
How dare he fill Ryan's head with lies? Calm yourself, Roderick. I've been doing my best to set him right. But he is only a child. He feels forgotten. Alone. He's waiting for his family, but every day my father tells him they will never come. That they've chosen their pride over him. I'll bring him up. I will get him back. He'll be with his family again. You tell him that. Ethan. My little brother. He stood up to Ramsay Snow. I mean... He saved our sister's life. And paid with his own. He was only a boy. From eyes, from eyes, we forced us born to eyes, we all return. The acoustics are white. The brother, I've sworn, I've sworn. Oh no! I'm not in the minority. Okay, you and 24% of players forged Marjorie's letter. Hell yeah, bitch. I did that. You and 70%, Jesus, refused to kiss Lord Whitehall's ring. Well, you know what? I don't regret that. I don't regret that. You and 48% of players won Roderick's betrothal. Ugh. <laughs> Okay. You and... <laughs> I think this one makes up for the fact that I got 90% on the next one. You and 4.5% of players sold out Cotter after he stole Finn's knife. Yes! <laughs> you and 90.7% of players killed Mira's attacker. I... At the second that I did it, I realised... The, like, I, I realised I didn't want to do it. Um, I, I, what was going through my mind was, I want a giant body count, but the savage decision would just be to run. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it's definitely fun being savage, uh, for... An hour and 46 minutes. Um, did you guys enjoy it? Let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next one. Uh, uh, uh.